you guys and welcome or welcome back to my channel if you're new here i'm kylie thank you so much for being here today and happy friday i am so excited these days have been going by so fast for me lately i don't know about you but even the weekends have been going by really fast i can't believe it it's march 25th truly can't believe it but i thought that i would start off a weekend in my life this weekend is kind of fun busy hectic so i thought i would bring you guys along and yeah it's 2 p.m and i'm still working for the day but i thought i would come on and say hello and start the video off don't mind this like sweater situation i have going on here i honestly like i used to think people looked silly when they tied their sweatshirt around their shoulders but my shoulders were cold <laughs> and this was tied around my waist and so i just kind of scooted it up and now i get it like i get why people do this because now i'm warm and i still have my blanket on my lap this blanket is like always on my lap when i'm working yeah i thought i would vlog this weekend Tomorrow we're actually going to DC, so I thought that would be fun to vlog. And today is actually Will and I's six month wedding anniversary, which isn't like a big deal in the grand scheme of things, but we're still trying to like find reasons to make a big fuss out of something. So we quite literally went to the grocery store yesterday and we're gonna cook dinner together tonight because why not? You know, why not have a cute little date night to celebrate six months of marriage? So that's what we're doing tonight. We're making one of our like favorite recipes together, so that'll be fun. Nothing really crazy is going on right now. Actually, as I say that, we are starting to put renovations in the talk. So I don't know what that means, renovations in the talk. What? <laughs> we're talking about doing some renovations to the house. So I obviously want to bring you guys along for all of that because that's probably going to be crazy. And also like, I want to see, I want to show you guys what the house looks like before renovations. And let me tell you, this house is perfectly fine. We're doing renovations because we want to do renovations and that's just what we want to do. So I'm excited to show you the house as is. And then we did just make our big first purchase for renovations today so we are having like one renovation starting in the next couple of weeks so i'm very excited about that and i really want to start editing my videos more in real time so that you guys can keep up to date with everything going on but if you're not already following me on instagram you should definitely follow me because then you would get the more up-to-date things that are going on on a day-to-day -day basis i'm gonna get back to work Gonna finish drinking my LaCroix. This is my favorite sparkling water flavor as of this past week when I tried it. I have been getting the lime ones from Trader Joe's, but I ran out. And this is the key lime one, and I feel like it has like the sweetness to it, but it's not sweet. I don't know, I just really like the flavor of this one, so highly recommend. And I'm gonna get back to work. Then we can chat some more later, maybe about the renovation, maybe show you what we're making for dinner. I don't know, but I'll see you guys in a bit. Okay, it's a few hours later and I asked Will what time he wanted to start hanging out for the night, AKA what time are we both getting off of work? And he got off at four and I got off at four. Sorry, I'm so tired. But anyways, he got off at four and I got off at four and I asked him if he wanted to just have like alone time for an hour. So he's down playing video games and I'm reading and I have my BFF next to me. These are our spots on the couch. Like she sits here and I sit here. <laughs> yes, she's in such a good mood. I just got up to grab an Alani new. This is not my favorite flavor, but we get the like huge variety pack from Sam's Club. It just makes sense for us. We both love to drink these. This one tastes like grape, the Cosmic Stardust one. I don't hate it, but my favorite one is the Cherry Slush one. Hands down, my favorite, so good. 
but I'm drinking this because it's 4 30 and I want to take a nap <laughs> I normally get an afternoon coffee but I was so busy at work today I didn't even think to make one <laughs> so that's where we're at and also we got Duncan this morning because I had my T-Mobile Tuesday coupon to use and I don't think there was any caffeine in that. <laughs> like it was just pure sugar. Um, so I did have a little bit of coffee, whatever little bit they put in with my cream and sugar, but that's about it. So yeah, I'm tired. <laughs> I don't remember how much sleep I got last night, but I don't know if I'll be getting a lot tonight. I will get into that like probably a little bit more later once Will and I finally make our entire plan that we want to do. But in the meantime, it's 4.30, so I have 30 more minutes of reading. And then I think we're going to take the dogs. And by dogs, I mean our dog and Will's family's dog that we're watching. I feel like I'm always vlogging when we're watching him. We're going to take them on a W-A-L-K. I have to spell it or else they'll know and then they'll get like crazy and then I think we're gonna make dinner and stuff So that's the plan. I keep moving my hand. I'm sorry. And yeah, I'm just gonna relax on this couch and read for a bit My six month old Six month old? I was gonna say my six month old husband everybody Kinkos! This is Kinkos. He wants to say hi. Oh, yes. yes, buddy. You two are too much sometimes. Okay. Do you guys want to go on a walk? <laughs> okay. That was funny. Is it a walk that you want to do? <laughs> do you see this? I don't even have my shoes on yet. Okay, let's go. back from our like 3.2 mile walk <laughs> and it's time to make dinner it's it's 6 16 and i'm just grabbing wow it's bright in here i'm just grabbing everything that we need to make Does dinner cabinet, right? yep so for the burgers we got these ground beef patties the only ones they had why is this the biggest napkin in the world it's not a napkin what is it it's a like a hand towel. That's what I meant. A hand towel. It seems like the biggest hand towel. It does seem very big. I don't know. Well, I didn't, this one's not hand, so I didn't want to use it. But no, I regret that. <laughs> it's fine. And then we also got this no sugar bacon, which will be interesting. It's not focusing. That's okay. So we're gonna cook these up, and then. I set out some cream cheese earlier to get to room temperature so it's easier to spread. And these brioche buns are what we're going to use. We have to have a chocolate butter and almond. Oh, we do. These are so good. Wait, I want to show the packaging. We just got these yesterday. They are amazing. Go get them. Trader Joe's. Trader Joe's. <laughs> okay. We're going to cook up the meat. We'll see you soon.
failed to mention earlier that we went to crumble i'm pretty sure i put in some footage of that like some b-roll earlier but we walked to crumble which is why it was like a three mile walk because it's like one and a half miles there one and a half miles back we got the triple chocolate chip mm -hmm. and a oatmeal iced. like white o iced oatmeal yeah. yes sorry comment down below who do you think chose what okay we're gonna try the oatmeal one first yeah yeah let's go for it okay. cheers it's good a little bit of cinnamon to it the part of me that didn't want to get this cookie was the cream cheese i'm not a big cream cheese frosting person i like cream cheese like we just had cream cheese on our burger yeah but i don't like cream cheese frosting but that one was good yeah it was pretty I good i thought it was good yeah nothing special though. next triple chocolate cheers Tastes like chocolate. This is the one that I picked. <laughs> Very good. I like. You can't go wrong. I love like chocolate, chocolate, chocolate things. So this is like totally yeah, up I, my alley. I give them both. Like I give the oatmeal seven. It's mm -hmm. I give that a seven as well. I give the oatmeal one like a seven point five. It gives me like the snickerdoodle cookie vibes. I don't really taste the oatmeal. Yeah. It kind of well, tastes like the an texture iced... in it is oatmeal. Like I could taste. Oh, like, I didn't get oh, that. Not taste, but like you know, like the flakes in oatmeal. Yeah. I, I could taste that. I didn't get that. It just tasted like a frosted snickerdoodle to yeah. me. And then the chocolate one. Chocolate. Always good. Yeah. Like anytime they make a chocolate themed cookie, we know this is going to be the base. Maybe not as many chocolate chips, but anyways, we have been watching The Servant on Netflix. No. Oh, creepy. Yeah. On Apple TV. Apple TV, yes. <laughs> and we're gonna get back to the episode that we're watching. We like to leave like a few episodes for us to watch because when you watch one episode, like I feel like yeah, cliffhangers. Well, can I just go on a little tangent real quick? Sure. So I don't know if anyone else has realized this. Let me know if you have. But I feel like streaming platforms have started to realize that everyone's streaming. So now they're taking advantage of us and having shows be released weekly. Mm -hmm. Or for example, you told me Ozark only released half the episodes mm -hmm. and they're going to release the other half sometime in the future. I feel like they're taking advantage of us and it's their way of trying to make sure we keep the subscription with the companies. Well, this is my thought. Mm -hmm. Because of COVID, they had to cram in filming and editing and they didn't have the same amount of time that they normally would have had because they had to stop production so my thought is that's why they're like but here, slowly letting them out instead of all at once because they I, didn't have the same time i don't think they're gonna go back though i think everything is gonna start like the but fact like bridgerton that, all the episodes are on netflix today is that right yeah i feel like netflix but like all the other ones like I know Paramount just released, like, I watched Halo. There was only one episode released. I know, like, a bunch of shows, like, um, that aren't really Hulu or Netflix. Mm -hmm. All the other cha all the other ones, though, are doing the one yeah. episode release thing. So well, I just... that, that is the case for, like, any <clears throat> Apple TV show. Yeah, and watch. it might just be because they don't have as much to provide. Mm -hmm. So you're paying more of a premium for... I don't, I don't really get it though, because HBO doesn't do it, I don't think. You, or, no, they do. Know. They do. Hmm. The HBO well, does it as well. That's Will's little rant on yeah. TV shows lately. To sum it up, we're watching The Servant. We're, off, we're also watching Severance. Great show. On Apple TV, which is really cool. If you like Black Mirror. That's what I was just going to yeah. say, yeah. Yeah, yeah we, finished, we finished one show recently, and I'm blanking on it. Didn't we? All right, let's think. Netflix... Oh, Inventing Anna. Yeah. We finished that recently. That's so basic. basic. The money is coming. Yeah, that show is really good. I like watching shows when they're trendy just because I understand what everyone's talking about. Like, I don't watch The Bachelor or, like, any of those type of reality shows. So, I don't get the memes. I don't get yeah. the inside scoop on what's going on in, we, like, the we, world. Yeah, we kind of have, like peaks of when we watch like a reality show mm -hmm. or watch the voice for example well like, in the summer we've realized that we like love island uk because it's summer in the so because you can go outside 
That's why we like it? I don't know. Well, I don't know. You're saying in the summer we like watching well, it. Well, so we, like... we watched it last year. Yeah. So we'll try again this but, year. But like we try to watch we another season after and it was like, well, I think also because there was like 50 episodes and I'm like, I yeah. can't do this again. <laughs> okay. Happy six months. Happy six months. Yeah. We each got each other a card. Can we talk about how our staircase looks blue? It does look blue. Hi, blue staircase. It's probably from the kitchen because the kitchen makes everything blue. <laughs> All right, and we end it there. I'm gonna get back to watching TV with my husband and yeah, we'll see you when we see you. I'll call you later. It is weird to call you my husband. Hello, happy Saturday. It's 8.30 and we are about to be in DC. We're just driving in right now and it's been an early morning to say the least. I woke up at like 6.30 to get ready and get on the road. And this is a very early morning for us for a Saturday. We normally, we were just talking about it. We normally kind of just sit in bed and lounge around, watch cartoons. <laughs> so I'm very excited that sky actually, it looks beautiful out. Very pretty. Please do not mind my banana peel. <laughs> We're getting ready to head in. Oh wow, we just drove into some traffic. Okay. Uh, 8.30 in the morning on Saturday. Yeah, what is up with that? I was gonna do my makeup in the car this morning and then I decided that I was gonna stress myself out a little bit too much to do that. So I did it in like seven minutes when we were at home, but I'm very excited to see the cherry blossoms. I'm, oh, there's a plane taking off. This is everyone wanting to go see the cherry blossoms. I hope this isn't everyone wanting to go see the cherry blossoms. Although, remember like three years ago, it was packed. Yeah. Well, we went in the middle of the day, I think. That's true. Well, we're hoping that we get to the cherry blossoms early in a sense that not a lot of people are gonna be there, but we'll see. I'm very excited to see the cherry blossoms, and then afterwards we're going to get brunch, and then we're gonna go to a museum, so I'm really excited to spend the day with you. Enjoy. And yeah, we'll see you when we're at the cherry blossoms. blossoms. Will's looking up the directions to the breakfast place that we're going to. I actually think we're getting one of these near us so I'm really excited. We've never been. It's called Milk and Honey but I'm really excited. The cherry blossoms are beautiful. They were at peak bloom I think yesterday. We're kind of away from all of the crowds over here and it is quite windy so I don't know if we even got a photo because my hair was in my face the entire time. These are the cherry blossoms. There's a lot of people out running this morning. I don't know why. It's freezing because it's windy. Yeah, it's freezing. Okay, there's also some people wearing dresses right now and I feel really bad for them. Like I feel cold for them. But we're gonna go walk to breakfast. I think we might go see the monument over there. The Washington mon Monument. Isn't it weird that it's just like in my frame right now? Yeah. Okay, let's navigate over there and then we'll go to breakfast.
hello you guys happy sunday long time no talk it's been actually quite a bit since yesterday when i was vlogging but i thought i would fill you guys in the weekend's not over it's actually 2 30 and i feel like we've just been on the go since yesterday so after we left the city we came home and we were home for two hours before we had to leave again so we were just crazy busy yesterday i just wanted to like fill you guys in and let you know what i'm doing today and kind of a lazy sunday but so yesterday i didn't really get to tell you guys but so we had planned to have brunch at Milk and Honey. We found out they didn't open until 11 and it, we were there around like 10, 15. We didn't wanna wait for 45 minutes to get brunch because we also had tickets to the Spy Museum at 12.30. So we didn't necessarily wanna miss out on that because we did buy tickets. We ended up going to somewhere else but it was really hard for us to find somewhere because a lot of places were closed because there was a marathon going on yesterday and then we found one place called like the smith or something like that and that was also like packed to the brim and their reservations were booked until 2 30. so we eventually found le pain quotidien and we went there which we got a chocolate croissant and then will got the belgium pancakes and then i got the egg and bacon skillet which was literally two eggs in a skillet with some bacon on top <laughs> i thought it was gonna be like something more elaborate anyways i digress we split both of those and then the chocolate croissant that was in like the pen quarter area if you're familiar with dc at all and then we walked back to where the spy museum was which was near the tidal basin it's like 10 minute walk from the tidal basin and that's where we went to see the cherry blossoms yesterday so then we went back and then after that it was about like two 2.30 maybe and we were like okay enough of the spy museum let's go home we had to we actually had will's mom come and let me get out while we were gone because we were also watching her dog and she had to pick him up so that worked out well and then once we got home we just kind of like relaxed for two hours and then we went and left to go babysit our friend's kid for the night so yesterday was very busy so now it's Sunday and this morning, so our church had a pastor switch recently and we weren't there for when the old pastor was there. So they did like a goodbye tribute to him today and we didn't know him. We've never seen any of his sermons. So we just watched from home because the church was completely packed. Like there was no parking, there was like no seats left. We felt bad taking a seat from someone who actually knew this pastor. So we just watched from home and i ended up making homemade biscuits because i had leftover buttermilk from a cake i made last week so i made homemade biscuits and we just had some eggs and turkey bacon with it this morning and it was nice to kind of have a slow morning since yesterday was like on the go and actually i just realized i took my rings off to make the biscuits and i need to put them back on so we had a slow morning watched church from home and then we just meal planned and i worked out and showered did like my whole shower situation which took a bit did like a hair mask shaved my legs all of my favorite things no they're not my favorite things to do but i do them anyways now i'm deciding what i want to do i have to go to the grocery store i also want to edit a few videos today i just cleaned up my desk area because this is where i'll put on makeup i keep it all in like this little cart situation and then i'll put it on my desk to do my makeup. I don't know what I want to do. Sorry. I just realized my hair looks crazy. I literally just got out of the shower. That's a little like recap of yesterday and this morning. And I don't really know what else we're doing today. I think today is just a, honestly a chill day, which I've been craving. And so I'm excited for that. I'm going to make a coffee and I'm going to sit here, edit a video. And then maybe once I finish editing the video, I can go to the grocery store and then come back and read a little bit. And also new episodes of Bridgerton just got launched. So I do want to watch that, but I'm not making that a priority because I can always watch that whenever I can't keep putting off posting a video. So I think that's what I'm going to do. Break. <laughs> okay. It's a few hours later. 
What are you doing? No. The hood. It's a look. <laughs> um, what time is it? It's 6.30? Where did the time go? Okay, it's 6.30. <laughs> I did some editing and some reading, caught up with some family members. We're about to leave to go to the grocery store finally. I have put it off this long. I've never done this. I mean, maybe I have, but most of the time I try to get in to the grocery store earlier, even sometimes Saturdays, and it's 6.30. So I think we're going to get pizza. The pizza shop is right next to the grocery store, so I think we're getting pizza and we're gonna watch a movie. So that's the rest of the night. So we're gonna go do that. I'll bring you guys along. Will I remember to vlog? Yes. I don't know. I'll challenge her. I'll make sure she does. Okay. Thanks, babe. Yeah, no problem. He actually got some clips for the, this vlog yesterday. Oh. All the clips you saw yesterday are for me. Your boy is a professional. Hire me. I charge rate. My rate is about $50 an hour, so not too bad. <laughs> right? It's pretty good. Yeah. So $50 if you want. If only you would edit my videos for me. Ooh. Now that I would not enjoy. It's like my least favorite part, sometimes. It's just like initiating it. We're gonna go to the grocery store. Pizza. I don't know if you could tell, but uh, we were running out of the grocery store. It's 37 degrees out and neither of us are wearing proper clothes for that. Go dress like it's spring. Yeah, I refuse to think that it's cold and that I will need to wear my winter coat again. I refuse to wear my winter coat again. So <laughs> we got pizza for dinner from our favorite place, Marco's, which is a chain that I did not know it was. And we're heading home. It smells so good. It's, it smells amazing. Comment down below what your favorite pizza topping is. Lately, I've been just liking cheese pizza, which is very weird. And actually, we haven't had pizza. In a while, for sure. Okay, so the Super Bowl was the last time that we had pizza, which is like a really long time ago, it seems like. And I'm really excited. I think I'm gonna end this video off here though because we're gonna probably rush put away the groceries so that we can eat the pizza. Thank you guys so much for watching this weekend in my life. Married with my husband. I hope you enjoyed all of our adventures to DC and everything like that. Comment down below what you wanna see from me next. Make sure you give this video a thumbs up and I will see you guys in my next one. Bye. Bye.